So I'm thinking, as I tend to do, that um, what the next step in communication between people might be. Because we've gone from just talking to each other, to shouting at each other, to um, loud hailers, to radio, to communicating with people without being able to see them even across the world. I think it's the ionosphere or something like that. The bottom line is I find it amazing that we would even conceive of being able to communicate with someone without being in close proximity to them. So the concept is what confuses me. I don't understand where we get the idea that we can possibly do that. So now I'm thinking maybe a step forward would be to have a system where you just could think at someone and communicate with them. Um, that's, that's not as insane as it at first appears because you can have brainwave analyzers or whatever that will recognize when you're thinking of somebody and then that could connect to a device somehow and then communicate with that person just by thinking about them. Um, there's no reason that I can see that that couldn't happen. And so one day people might talk to each other, to each other just by thinking about them and thinking words to say. And it might come to a situation where um, people are doing this all the time and they look back at how we used to communicate with each other and shake their heads and couldn't imagine it. They think it was insane that you had to get a device like a phone and, and press buttons to communicate with someone when now you can just think and you're talking to someone. So I think that's definitely possible and um, it's one of the ways I can see that communication, communication can advance in future because the idea is obviously the first thing that has to happen. The concept has to be created and then we proceed to do it. I mean, we have television, mobile phones now, computers, and it all started with just an idea because the things we have now seem insane. But ideas always the first step.